Health Check with Nurse Jen is presented by Island Cancer Center. Half a day, I'm Nurse Jen and it's time for your health check. Do you experience severe knee pain that limits your everyday activities? Is your knees always swollen and just doesn't seem to get better, even if you rest it or take pain meds? Maybe you're noticing that you're bowing in or out with your legs. Knee osteoarthritis can affect your every move when climbing stairs, walking, running, even just sitting down or laying down. Knee replacement surgery can help bring relief, but most doctors almost always advise trying other treatments first and surgery to be the last option. Most doctors will start with a consultation with weight loss discussions. Every pound gain puts an extra three pounds of pressure on your knees. Initial interventions include RICE, RICE, and that stands for rest, ice, compression, and elevation with over the counter medications such as acetaminophen, ibuprofen, Motrin, Aleve, or Naproxen. Stronger medications are available by prescription. Also, some individuals use creams and ointments to rub into the knee, such as Salumpas, Bengay, Thermoworks and CBD oils, massages, creams, or hot and icy. And if these options don't provide relief, a medication can be injected into your knee joint. Steroid injections to fight inflammation and give you fast pain relief can last up to several months. Exercise strengthens the muscles that support the knees. So yes, physical therapy is often a common referral for individuals with knee pain. A physical therapist can also recommend a cane, a splint, or a supportive knee brace. And finally, if you've exhausted all the initial recommendations, surgery may be recommended. Arthroscopic surgery is a type of surgical intervention where a thin tube is inserted with a tiny camera to view the inside of the knee. The surgeon can remove the damaged knee cartilage that's been causing the pain and get you back to work within a few days. And the last option is knee replacement surgery. This is a common operation that involves replacing a damaged, worn out, or diseased knee with an artificial joint. Your chances of success are much greater if you lose the extra weight before the surgery. I'm Jennifer Artero, registered nurse, reminding you, don't wreck yourself, health check yourself. Health Check with Nurse Jen is presented by Island Cancer Center.